Hello, everybody, and how are you all doing on this beautiful Wednesday evening? What the hell's going on here? Eisen, have you gone mad right now? You're just doing this to get even with Pan, aren't you? Okay, first of all, bullshit. I, I was crazy well before I started streaming. And second of all, maybe. <laughs> anyway, um, as you can all that tell, we are back once again to tackle some more of this, and I'm keeping a close eye on that HP. I do not what happened what happened the last time I did something like this to happen, where apparently the game thought it was a good idea that uh, I get to keep my levels and everything, but for some odd reason, um, the game just decided, uh, yeah, remember uh, how you were able to keep all that progress? Guess what? You have zero out of zero HP. Have fun. You should finish this run. You should finish this run. You should finish this run. And guess what? This is me not caring. Uh, I'm trying to remember. Uh, but yeah, I mentioned it before on the um, stream, Madoodle. Um, I'm just going to bring it up again. $200 donation. Total accumulated tonight. Do that, and I will indeed get back and finish this run. Until then, we're keeping this train wreck a-rolling. Okay, so seriously, where upper left section of the map? Oh, you know what? I think I know where it is. It's where I was before earlier. It's where I was before earlier. It was right here. Because that one cave in the corner, that's where I was supposed to be in. Which I believe is right here. And I'm just going once again, because yes, I am that parent. Okay, good. Encounters are on. Your image, what? This is definitely gonna get dicey. That's the case. But, uh, I'm sure it will be fine. Of course, the one who was um, able to do the sword dance on uh, Facebook. Hot ah, damn, that was some serious damage there. And yeah, not too concerned about that one. But yeah, this should finish it off. Also, I just realized, it occurred to me, if I'm going to be doing what people out there think I'm doing, uh, I should buy a couple stuff first. But I say a couple, more like a few things first. So, why don't we just head directly northwest from here. So west by northwest. Still. So. Okay. Meanwhile, back in the Phantom Village. Get in here. Oh, right. Uh. 
probably nothing, but, uh... Actually, I only have enough for a few of them, so... Let's just get three of those, since I already have four. And why the hell not one of those? And I believe... Let's throw a... Added stuff I want to sell. Excalibur, the best sword ever in the entire game. Masahune, the best sword in the entire game. Each one five years, so you know what? Can't even use them. Why the hell not? Blood sword, it, it, it had to come. Uh, also, Holy Lands, Rune Axe, Thor's Hammer, all that good shit. Uh, yeah, we're selling them. Can't even use them, so what's the point? What is the point? I ask you. Also, um, yeah, get rid of Ash Kitchen. What what good has he done? What good has he done, I tell you? Well, I'll tell you what good he did. Nothing. Nothing. He's just sitting there making his own Pikachu do a damn thing. <laughs> That's all. So, Kaiser Knuckle might get out that badly, and... <sighs> well, see, uh, that that's just the problem there, Jeff. If you consistently ask why, um, chances are you're not. got at least two more of those. Alright. Now, for real this time, let's go back to that cave and do this properly. So, since we went west by south west, actually, I should say west by north, we're gonna go east by south east. Uh, here. Maybe a little bit north, but. Oh, that was close. It was actually to the east. Alrighty. Anyway, moving on. Everyone else is more than likely able to do uh, dance moves to phase through that. You know, until um, I get confused, in which case, uh, phase will be stick with this. Desert killers, oh no. Oh, oh. 
Coward! Oh well, we got one Desert Killer down. And so, here we are at the final falls. Only one thing for us to do here, and uh, at this point, it's ridiculous. Aquagel, not to be confused with Aquafina. Difference between the two again? Oh. Either way, maybe he's doing fine. I'm pretty sure that I'm just dead. Okay. I'll admit, you sure did an embrace. It failed, but you did an embrace. Time and effort, we got this. Oh no, I'm curious. Uh, only one. Ah, yes. So, this 
best way I can get that one. I want the left side. This I definitely need to check out. Yeah, not gonna work. And as far as question mark, question mark, question mark goes, uh, I'd rather not figure out what that is. Although we're about to find out. Right now. Unless I kill it soon enough. Hey! Who knows? Maybe I'll even get a special bonus for uh, taking out question mark, question mark, question mark. Oh! Oh! Um, that's undead. I can't believe I didn't notice that. I saw through it. Granted, it did take me a while, but I saw through it. Also, um, this was a secret area there. Probably can't go there. Huh. <sighs> That's a return. You know what? I got an idea. This is why you get you all matched up. Did a jitterbug herself. So see. Oh. Look, we're still all topped off. Had to use a Phoenix down, but we're fine. So yeah, that's not gonna work. So if I can't. Go there. I guess that means we gotta go here. Oh, hi, Toneberry. I missed you, buddy. Now, I wonder. Um, it's a definite show. Here we go. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. Hmm. Not gonna work. And I get the feeling this is probably a heavy character, so death blow is probably. Uh, 
person's first. If it works. Uh, it did. I should probably get this also. Or... This could be bad. Well, this only got uh, a bit hairy at this point. Did massive damage to that. So yeah, at this point, uh, my only hope is just stick it down before it gets any closer. And oddly enough, that is working. Hey there, cool Al. How's it going? <laughs> you thought I was going to say a uh, son of a bitch, didn't you? <laughs> what I tell you? We're fine. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the sound alert. That's made out of mercury. Uh, let me just check that. Let's just take him out the old fashioned way. The good old ass beat. Ooh, that's what the death is called. Neither matters because I'm pretty sure this battle is ended. Not to be confused with air slash. Huge, huge difference. Uh, let's see. Just about for a bit. Based on the holes, it looks like. That's a really good question. Left or right? Left or right? Uh. Let's go left. Yeah, I never thought I would actually say this. That would be a fantastic time for you to do this mystery box on uh, this jerk. Because, yeah, you Thank you! It's like the game knew! Yeah, you need that MP back.
here, but uh, first of all, I see. Same thing, not going to work. So let's just do what we always do in the tag. Probably, probably for the best, I stopped. theory to the test. Are you undead? Oh, yes, you are. So this whole time, I was actually feeding it. Oof. The important thing is, we figured it out. We solved the mystery in this mystery machine. sure you're dead now. Oh, yeah. You're not just dead. You're super dead. You fool. Far worse things we could be dealing with. Speaking of which, uh, what blade do we have? Man, here. That would be where the critical strikes are coming from. Also, uh, lest we forget the poison.
But then we gotta ask ourselves, is this ludicrous only for Balky to jump in and say, well, don't be ridiculous. Oh, also, I, I see the passages. Doi. got something that increases uh, magical power, so uh, no need for that. Yeah, there. Alright, it's time for us to deal with you, and I'm pretty sure you're dead now. That you are, so let's just, uh, stick with, uh, physical attacks. Except for you, you just defend. Since, um, I do remember being able to do that in other parts of the map. I think the game's just being wonky on me again. So I wonder. Yeah, now it works. Can't shift over, but that's okay. At least I can move up and down to prove it's not just me. Also, I am fairly certain you are anything but me, so we should be fine. Yeah. In fact, uh, still fist. Let's see, but it's probably under a different name if I had to guess. Remembering what they're called beforehand. Uh, for reference sake, I am using the original uh, anthology booklet, so if it seems like I'm taking too much time, there you go. Uh, what are they called? Probably. Okay, that's probably what they're I could dark spark them and half their levels to make it worthwhile. Uh, considering how much health they have, uh, I think it's far more beneficial for me to just do this. So 
At least with Chief's equipped with the Enhancer. Should I elevate the spells? That looked like it did a whole bunch of nothing. Not saying I'm just. Either way, I'm going to change my strategy here. Especially since if one fell, the other two should fall that easily. And they did. Definitely finish those. Moral might still live. Yeah, it did, but that's okay. It's a good excuse for me to um, drain its MP and health. Especially since it missed with that sport attack. Survive regardless. Phoenix down. Good. Wasted. Well, I say wasted. We used up one long way. So not that big a deal. And at least this time we're just dealing with one of them. Ow! That finished you off there. Could have been better. But again, no survive. Not sure about a back attack, though. That could be a bit problematic. Especially when that happens. More than anything, this is a perfect time for my kids. Ouchies. Bye bye, buds. Do me a favor and die. Uh, no way to get that. So, the other one. And not heal everyone, but get close enough. Won't kill off the coral, but at least get rid of the murky bats. That will definitely get rid of the coral, though. Make it way through there. We just found a save point. Uh, 
I'm not going to heal everything, but at least it will actually... Good opportunity for us to get rid of both of our tents. Not going to fully heal us. Because we might still be off. Yeah, we'll be off by a bit as far as MP goes, but everything else will be fine. about time we got rid of those bats. Oof. Yeah, I figured if nothing else, take care of that first. There we go. No ass for you. That was very rude, Coral. Now get back up and tell me you're sorry. Coral. Yeah, probably for the best we uh, not worry about that. And another enhancer. But uh, we don't have any equipped sword abilities, so that'll do us no good. Okay, can we take care of you? Because if we can, oh, that would do tremendous amount of damage. There we go. Problem solved. Oh, you're still dancing. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. <sighs> when will you ever learn, Aizen? When will you ever So 
Now we're not going to make that same mistake again. No, sir. map I'm using, um, shows holes, um, none of the holes covered up, except for there. Hey, I'm... Didn't mean to touch that, but whatever. I'm sure we'll be able to backtrack one way or the other. Besides, nothing else, we got the other tablet. What more could we ask for at this point? Oh yeah, that's right, we never did get to face off against you. Oh well, at least we can f defeat you that easily. What the fuck is that thing? So yeah, that boss was so impressive, we, we don't even get to fight against it. But yeah, before we do anything else, uh, let's change to the Coral Rings. We're gonna lose our Perma Haste over this, but you know what? At the very least, we will have protection against water. And considering we're going up against Leviathan, yeah, we kind of need that. Also, uh, just be on the same side. Let's do this, buddy. Also, uh... Good thing that happened. Uh, just be on the safe side. Mighty guard. And I don't think it cast haste gun, though, so... But if all it can do, well, I say all it can do. If it counters with Tidal Wave, we'll be fine. Let's see. Multiple. It's possible I could, if it goes through, Dark Spark him three or two times, and then he would be susceptible to level three. But again, that's provided it does work. I'm not going to expect it to work, but we'll see. Also, how's it going, Van Anning? Thank you so much for the 11 party raid. Uh, also, thank you for the sound But uh, yeah, it, it, it's important that uh, we stop this for the time being because, hey, let's get the guns ready. This just in. Eisen just hired a random guy to prep his counter raid. Let's go and watch. Yes, thank you very much, Pan Anning, for the raid. It is summertime, which of course means it's time for a fiesta. 
Of course, I could just go in there, guns blazing anytime I want to in the void. Um, if I want to at least have a chance, quote unquote chance, of going up against both, um, almost said Warmack, Omega Weapon and Shinryu, uh, yeah, this is what the backtrack is for. But let's see how things go at this point. Um, What's another thing? So far, nothing springing to mind here, so... At this point, just... Attack and hope that we proxy Sword Dance. Because worst case scenario, it's gonna counter with Tidal Wave. And thanks to our uh, Coral Wings that are equipped, it's gonna do all of what kiss. I say unless things get very dicey, uh, we could probably honor this one and get through it just fine. So yeah, those who just came in from the raid, how you all doing? You getting ready for 4th of July, those who are in the U.S. here, otherwise everywhere else is just like... Uh, but just in case you might be a bit confused of where we're at, um... Just as a quick update, um, we cleared out most of the rift. The last boss we went up against was Twin Tanya, so... This means once we're done with Leviathan, take care of the whole special weapons, DDO, and what have you. Uh, this just means we have a straight shot going into the final part of the rift. Oh no, Buds has been entangled. If only it meant something other than a temporary stun. And of course, uh, you'd think we could block against or absorb Aqua Breath. Memory serves, I think that's wind based, which, considering it's got the name Aqua in there, kind of counterintuitive. Not that it matters much because we. Of course, Leviathan's final message uh, before we struck it down was, You killed me, to which we just reply, Good. We. Oh, it just kicked me out. Okay, you know what? No. No, no, no. We still have goodies to get in there. We're going back in. This time, uh, without the encounters. And it's my question from earlier. If I went to the right... Uh, what brought me here? So, I guess either way it wouldn't matter, but... Eh. Best we know now. Because, of course, is there any reason for me to try and do this 100%? Uh, especially since I'm going to do an actual run of this game uh, for the Final Fantasy Retrospective. No. Is that going to stop me from doing what I do? Hell no, it's not going to stop me. If anything, it's going to encourage me to keep doing this shit. <laughs> Owie. Whatever. We got what we wanted there. And another Aegis Seal. Let's try this one more time. There you go. See, it's not that difficult. You know how to do this. Just stop pulling a dumbass. 
That's the best way of how you can avoid that. Just stop pulling a dumbass. Alright, now that that's been taken care of. Encounter's back on. We gotta go up against more Ironbacks. Also, I, it just occurred to me, uh, we still have the coral rings equipped, so let's not attack them as we are. Okay, okay. There we go. Like nothing ever happened. And speaking happened. Let's go ahead and rest. Who knows? If I saved up enough money, hopefully bleh, I could be able to invest in not just the remainder of the angel rings, but maybe some flame rings as well, since I believe for the most part, I should say, uh, it should counter one of Omega's weapon attacks, which I believe is Thermal Atomic Rays. So yeah, back to Mirage Village we go. And thankfully this game realized that we were in a hurry because it brought me in one step. don't even have flame rings, so let's see if we can sell some useless junk we don't need. Uh, well, we can only equip one shield, and I believe at this point, um, it's going to be either the Aegis shield or crystal shield, so why not? Let's sell these off. And if I really wanted to, I could equip uh, four ribbons, since I do have a dancer and have the equip ribbon ability. If I wanted to, I don't have to do it. And we'll sell off two extra reflect rings. Oh, speed shakes. Full of shuriken. Rune blade. Titan axe. And our spare enhancer. And I believe... Yeah, we did it. We got all the equipment you will ever need. Will we actually need the angel rings? Probably not, but if we do, it's there. <clears throat> now, unless I'm mistaken, let us rush back to there. Quick save. And now, back into the rift we go. Ah. Also, I should check. Um, So, ordinarily, I wouldn't mind um, going for multiple battles of this. Also, uh, I'm going to guess it's... susceptible to it. Hey! 
Baku guessed right. Yep. Also, I should make sure uh, at this point. Good. It would be a shame if I was doing all this grinding just to find out. Oh, it was regular damage. And I believe um, we went up against you. It didn't really give out much of anything, so let's just. Uh, Yo, fuck this shit on out. And just leave that battle. Okay. Ordinarily, I wouldn't mind uh, going up against them, except it's a back attack. Where they get first strike, I'm not looking forward to that. Yeah. Yeah, just, um... Good news is, worst case scenario, I'm level 4 multiples, and I guess level 2. Or worst case scenario. But just to make sure we're topped off. A little bit of white wind, never heard of that one. Yeah, much better. So yeah, now uh, Cheeks is susceptible to level 3 and level 5. Careful of that. Well, you know, we can just do that. That's fine too. Definitely ain't gonna cast any magic attacks, that's for damn sure. I cast Eroka! Not enough MP. Okay, then I, uh, I cast Eroka! Not enough MP. Uh, cast Eroka? Not enough MP, goddammit! That leads to nowhere. The right left led to a treasure. Left, however, leads to progress. And yeah, right just led to a treasure. We'll skip that. <laughs> Don't care if it doesn't work for anyone else. I got I got it. Uh, real! Just for Uh, what are... So, so I get the feeling I know what they are, according to this. Uh, ah! Didn't have to do that to begin with, I could just do this. Oh. Well, now it doesn't matter that I cast that, either way. Alright. And I'm pretty sure by now, um, level spells won't matter, or at least that much. Let me just move forward from here. Yeah, that's way. Actually, no, that is not the way forward. It's the left one. You 
know, if I really, really wanted to be a dick, it just occurred to me, I didn't use the last, um, monolith tablet, but whatever. We'll see how the first, uh, fight against Omega goes, although considering it says very least we should be 50 plus, and, uh, at best we're, uh, exactly mid-40s. Yeah, that doesn't send me, uh, much good vibes from there, so... I already forgot about you guys. Uh... Probably not a big deal, but I'm gonna check. Okay, so... Not that big deal. We'll just do that. Think about this, we'll do that. That's enough. There we go. Hm, got a free antidote out of it, so why the hell not? Well, we already established, uh, let's go for here. No, not death. Flare! There we go. Wow, it's being really generous about throwing uh, the boss one guy towards us. Not that I'm complaining, mind you. I will take it. Means I don't need to take that many breaks as a turn how the hell I'll get through this. said that now we come across Ugh. those flames. Nothing. The best I can do, um, just rely on uh, Arrowhead to finish them off. And since Arrowhead costs more, Cast was severe. I should have rest. Of course, I say should, like that's good. Give me. It wasn't. But no problem. We still made it through. Got to grab something here, so uh, 
remember who you were supposed to be. Uh, I'm gonna guess... Level 5? Probably wrong, but we'll see. Nope, not even close. So I believe Oculus is supposed to be those Urukat enemies. Most definitely. Uh, so, I'm gonna try level 2 mold. If it affects it, we know what that enemy is. Yep, that's what it was. Apparently, it was the Symmetric enemy, which you'd think would be great. It does nothing for me. So, before I can even attempt to do anything, I'm gonna try. You would be in try to confuse this if you attempt to take go. Because you can do that. So now it's just a matter of waiting. Why uh, kill the enemy when it can kill itself, dude? It's dumbassery. Obvious reasons it's not going to do enough damage. Although I could let it kill itself. That's always a viable option. There's a reason they gave us this safe point. So I'm gonna get 
give this one attempt. There's absolutely no way it's going to work. I'm going to delude myself in thinking that's the case, but there's no way that's going to work. Yeah, as for those who can, I'm going to give them um, a quick rod, because I believe um, Thunder is a must here. out that I'm dead, but at least I'm gonna turn around while I do so. Okay, let's um, defend for now. So I know that's good. That just went to shit. That didn't count. I know what some of you at home are saying. That did not count. Yeah, make sure it counters off. Try again. Oh fuck, that one was tragic. Said that, I'm pretty sure um, everyone else is dead unless I top us off. Uh, I'm sorry, what was that? You actually missed with that? I do not approve of that. I sincerely do not approve of that. Alright, it's got slump. I 
that's definitely not gonna work. It's not gonna work, but I have to try. One night. Holy shit. Hmm. So yeah, were it not for his auto reflect, I could be able to pierce through that. So yeah, you know what, I, I'm, I'm free to call this one a wash. One more attempt, um, that's not, um, due to my confidence. After that, if it doesn't work, then I'll just cut my losses and actually save my Also, can you please just finish me off already? You were so close to doing so, and then you decided to tell me great. Okay, then. <clears throat> uh, first off, turn that off. Uh, hmm. Call me crazy. Since he does have a uh, rocket punch, I can confuse me. Let's just have that on. Obviously, blue magic, unless I'm using white wind and or uh, mighty guard, is not going to do well. So, we'll see how this goes. Wow. That did 
good absolute buckness. Last I checked, Meteor does phase through. Um, like so. Of course, it does very little damage. Let's see, there's no. Pretty sure Rainbow Wind makes uh, it so it does half the damage. In this fucktoos. <laughs> yeah, good, good use of that guy. possible move I can do is that. May as well just finish me. We've we pretty much established at this point um, the party I have absolutely no match for Omega. Let alone at our level. So it, it's not worth it. Switch back to dance for you. Um, blue magic for you. You got blue magic. Uh, and blue magic. So that's been taken care of. Enhancer. We'll try it. You just you know, see if it.
Santa, so, um, you know, let's see if we remember is that it. All right, um, yeah, don't, don't feel like it. No offense, it's just the Great Dragon. I'm pretty sure, while not undead, um, has undead properties, a.k.a., um, any draining attack will actually heal him and do damage to you instead, so uh, I'm just going to say no. Yeah, the rest I'll take on, though. Uh... Or rather, what I can do possibly against them. That'll give me an easier time. Uh, yeah, not really. Not really. So, at this rate, I think the best thing I can do is just... So why not? Three dragon fangs. Not that I need them, but there you go. And it's just the same thing. focus on physical damage from them.
serves going up the staircase via straight ahead is just leading to uh, a one-way door, so that's not going to work. Oh, well, we could deal with the Shadow Dancers that easily. Also, what was that you just want? Ice Brand. Okay. It's a Night Sword, so I can't wield it. And we do still have some old men to deal with, so why not? Feels true form. This is in Old Man Reveals True Form. Not that big a deal, but just to be on the safe side. Yeah. Yeah, that feels much, um... I hope you realize that. Oh boy. Let's hope we deal with this in the easiest way possible because we just lost Lena and Ferris in a way that we can't get them back. that fight, nothing bad happened. Despite what some may claim, 
nothing bad happened. So I was kind of hoping a worst case scenario that in circle would have happened to anyone else, and then all I would have to do is just cast return. But of course, the one person who only has time magic right now is Ferris, so yeah, that kind of ruined that plan. Yeah, honestly, that move. While damaging, not necessarily. care of all the old men. So, before we actually enter the true final part of the rift, we may as well get ourselves through here. Jimbo. Ah, yeah, man. Oh, so it should be fine, but you never know. Ouchies. Stop stabbing yourself! Stop stabbing yourself! Stop stabbing yourself! <laughs> Not that it matters, you're down now. Right. Oh, you had me going there, game. You had me going. I thought I got the rare drop that the um, blech, famous samurai Yojimbo gave out. But no. Yeah, it was just the Fuma Shuriken. But it matters because uh, it's time to go up against the Furies. Really. Um, it is time for us to make our way to the final part of this game. Uh, 
we can easily undo that just by doing that. Dance of Macabre. Oh! It's, it's undead now. Well, guess what? We actually can use the holy water. Not that it matters because battles are. Yeah, time to enter the true final part of the rift. That's not good in my book. That's not as well. Um, not sure if it's going to work. Uh, no. Unless, um... Uh, Alright, it is susceptible to Doom, so I just need to buy my time. Provided we can live! You know, that's kind of the other requirement there. Also, uh, you're, you're thinking of the wrong target there. You're thinking of uh, Ferris right now. Oh. Just need about our time, because apparently uh, they're not immune to do. No, why the hell not? But now the real question, who is going to die again? Uh, Kryle and, uh, Blade. Hooray. This has proven anything to me. Um, Mighty Guard might be a necessity at this point. So this is the Fen for the time being. We'll see what happens after uh, Doom Counter goes down. Uh, yeah, it, it, it's 
get to the point where I'm saying, some, some, please stop me. Some, please, please stop me. Alright, and survey says, okay, no death counter. Good, good. It just counters me here. Nothing else. And of course, this drops me. Because I took that enemy down, so I don't need to worry about it. Nope, 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 nope. Already dealt with you. Don't feel like dealing with you again. Let this noise, I'm out. What did I just tell you? Fuck this noise. Now, don't try and tell me otherwise, game. But look, it's our boy Greg! So now it's just a matter of dealing enough damage to it that we uh, finish this map off. Tasty damage. Tasty, tasty, tasty. Terrific. Yeah, let's see... Wait a minute. What? Sounds! That is no beast! Just butts! Well, in case you should have said something sooner! I don't like it here, you know. Creepy monsters look around every corner, and I can't find the way out! Crimes. <laughs> I'm gonna have a nervous breakdown. Well, anyway, how'd you get in here? Or rather, uh, how do you get out of here? Oh, uh, just go that way. Ah, I see! Let us egress post-haste, then! By the way, will we get out of here? Let's say we have a few spectacular adventures together. You know, just as five. Uh, oh, yeah, I forgot. You gotta do that whole saving the world thing going on for me. Well, if you do make it out safely... Ha! <laughs> what am I saying? No ifs about it! I'm certain we'll meet again! And when we do, I hope you'll consider me, uh... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Hasta la bye bye. Oh, Greg, don't ever change. All right, what do we have here? Gorgon, Gorgamera. Uh, is unknown by anything other than here? Uh, not seeing anything of the source. Otherwise, uh, well, that doesn't help me. So that means it's time to play the guessing game. I guess it's the Fobble. Mm. If that's the case, uh, let's. Yeah, good shot. Was I right? Uh, that's not the end. Uh, so it's not susceptible to level 5. Oh. oh. Okay, so if not that, maybe this? Ah! Okay. Wrong enemy. We figured it out. We still figured it out. That's all that matters. So yeah. 
that's the case, they're, they're not that bad. Hit like a truck when they want to, but otherwise, not that bad. I just realized you don't give out experience. Ah, there's the bell for more. So that's the case. Let's try it. Right idea, wrong enemies. Yeah, you are not dropping experience. Which I'll manage, but that still concerns me. Just you, just level 3 flare. Nobody's business. La 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 la. Let's go back just to be safe. I did not. Good thing I went back. And Necromancer. I'm pretty sure you have undead features, so... Fairly certain, even if you were a um, multiple of five, According to this, you're not. Uh, that's not going to work. However, if I'm reading this correctly, you should also be susceptible to level 3 flare. And you are, so let's just do that. survive. Okay, so now I have that. Alright. And before I think about tackling that, also mind flayers. Let's see. Born this. 53, so. fairly certain nothing's going to work against them. Uh, how much health again? Born this. Not that many. Ugh. Figured out nothing else, take down at least one of them. So we said we did. And mark it in our monster compendium.
Alright. Take care of that. Woo! Blast on that one. Thanks for saving me the trouble there. Probably not gonna finish it off due to being a bad Just because your enemy ally accidentally attacked you, that only counts as taking the punishment on me. I mean, I know that's technically right and everything, but come on. That's a huge concern for me. Also, um, not including one specific other enemy, uh, I think this is the last regular enemy. Let's see. First of all, getting rid of that one. Yeah, that's a weird thing. They have heavy defenses, yet, according to the guide, have very, 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 very Since it's not um, giving me anything else, may as well just take me out. There's a reason I'm going here rather than anywhere else. And the main reason of why I wanted to top off my health before doing anything else. We have one last, um, checkpoint to burn ourselves. can against Necrophobe, it means nothing. We must deal with the barriers first. Oh, I know, uh, what thing we can do with you. Uh, Mighty Guard. And we already have haste to so This might hurt. Let's 
some of that. Also, considering what they have, probably for the best we switch to something else. So let's switch to the Enhancer. Not gonna lie, I was very close to saying Onhinder. That's something completely different. nothing else, I definitely have the opportunity to um, I feel like now it should be dead. Now you're dead. My barriers of invincibility! You left me no other choice! Have a taste of my true power! And it's all you can eat! But you could use your power. Uh. Let's, I don't know what you can do. Uh, let's attempt level 3. This is not to level 3, so that's good. I'm not expecting. Let's see if Bolt works. Yes, it is. And probably a good thing, too, because that vacuum wave, if done correctly, can do lots of damage. Uh, I'm not going to do level 5 death because that would just ruin the fun. Uh, what about level 4 Rapid Out? Not susceptible to that. But definitely old and uh, flavor, so we at least have a method of attack. That's not correct. 
Oh, well. Hopefully, we can deal enough damage to you this way. So it really doesn't matter regardless what happens, but if I am able to uh, drain enough health, I would like to summon Gray one more time. dead people, so why does it want you to be dead? Good question! <laughs> well, one thing's for certain. Um, well, not exact... Uh, well, it did have leads, but... Um, Got it, baby! Greg's back! Am I fashionably late to the party? Why, hello there! Surprised to see me? Ha! As if I'd leave you in the lurch. I'd look like a jerk for all of history. As if I'd let that happen. <laughs> You've got a big fat mouth. If you're really so good to fight. Then you can be the first one to die! Not that it matters, because at this point, um... Infinite health. Wanna bet that? Do your worst, Baldy! You can't even hold a birthday candle to the blazing flame of my winning spirit! Trial! Your grandfather. He was a pretty strong guy. Grandpa. And you, Ferris. Try falling in love or something. Who knows? You might even learn a thing or two about yourself.
Yeah, all the damage you could do to Greg would can easily just be undone. Lena, you're always so caring towards everyone in Hanos. Never lose that pure heart of yours. The cheeks. The only regret I have is that I wanted to fight you one more time. Mono a mono, of course. You have admiral companions. I envy you. Oh, for the love of God, but stop blocking. Thank you. And now we just watch the rest of this battle. Ah, enough of this! Die! Ha! <laughs> I believe that's my line! So yeah, that necrophobe is fucking... Maybe he just hated others, so he wanted to see himself die. Who knows? But more importantly, farewell, Greg. In our timeline, he didn't explode. He just got transported to another dimension, where he is very much needed. And there technically is one other monster we still have yet to go up against. Um, <laughs> you all know what's happening next. Although, technically speaking, uh, I really should engage in uh, one more easy battle, because we have to go up against this. So where are you, one drop? Not the best of solutions, but we can work with this. <laughs> Hell air Enos. Which speaking of, happy 4th of July, all of my American brothers. Uh first off, let's be rid of I believe we do this up until we see the Wonder Rod, or Wonder Wand cast Reflect. So, just... Let's protect. Just make it easier on our selves. I'm sorry, what? Not too concerned about this. Easily fixable. Oh, at this rate, I may as well just have everything else in the back. That's 
as a cop. That should be Kirana. There's Reflect. Got a free crystal helmet on that. Can't use it, but good to know. Also, uh, just my own personal benefit, wasn't it? Okay. Just need to find the right button, so that way uh, I won't have to resort to using my phone to take the photograph, should I win this. Which, regardless, whether or not I beat Shinryu, my main concern is uh, EOX death, which now I know which one it is. But <clears throat> uh, well, with that said, spectacles, testicles, wallets, and watch. Um, all I ask in return is for you. Please don't kick me in the crotch. Actually, um, keep the army sandals on. Now we cast um, Berserk on it, so now it's only going to do one attack. My god, is it going to be super powerful. That can prove to be a bit problematic if that's the case. So now that we're done with that, back to Enhancer and Dancer. It's pointless trying to um, try and do uh, reviving because what's the point? Yeah, I get the feeling no matter what I do, it's just gonna have the same result. So now here's the hoping I can kill it before I run out of Phoenix Downs. Uh, so yeah, may as well go all out. Actually, at this point, um... Just auto battle until someone dies. Like now. And the funny thing is, I actually started with less because of the situation earlier, but whatever. There's more timing on my end. Yeah, let's focus on the battle right now.
Yeah, ordinarily I'd be super pissed that um, the Meteor isn't doing that much damage. If the physical attacks sometimes, if it's not um, Sword Dance that's doing damage, then um, yeah, I have no idea. I say, if you had time magic, you too could cast me here. Not. Oh. Take that, picture. Okay. So good news. We got something to send. A great bot, and just as an add bonus, do that. Uh, got the Ragnarok. Uh, oot. Now I just need to find um, where that picture was stored at. And of course, um, knowing me and how I set everything up, that could be a bit problematic. that where it would usually be? Well, one way to find out. Uh, let's see. Again, uh, da -da -da. users, me. Uh, uh, documents. That is. why I hate the settings here, because, um, yeah. Uh, if it could show me the pictures, which, that's the case, um, just pictures. It's too morning for me. Yeah, to be fair, it's too morning for me, too. Um, here's an easier answer I can find. Um, let's see, Community Hub. Maybe I can find it from there. Screenshots. How do I share screenshots? Show on disc where it is. Uh, 
Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay, so apparently it was in a weird, weird photo where, um, location where I would never have been able to find it. So it's a good thing I checked this up. Uh, excuse me for a second. Gotta load this back up. La la la. Alright. Sign in. Alright. Um, hopefully I can just drag and drop. Uh, that's not it. Oh, maybe I gotta post this. Yeah, post it up on It's via Steam. Uh, community. Screen master. Screenshots. Just show a single solitary link for that. Because uh, here's the thing I found the picture, I know what to do. It's doing it on Gregbot's site that's the problem. Because it says it needs uh, the victory picture link. And the only other option there is um, submit buttons. So, yeah, that's not going to work. See, that's what I thought. So, where is the damn link for it? Unless I just got to find it from there. Oh, maybe that's why. What about now? Okay, there we go. Jesus. Whew! It was finding the damn button was the real issue. But, either way, while um, I've clearly proven that um, I am nowhere near a match for um, Omega with the current party I have, at the very least, the very least, I have beaten Shinryu. And right now, I can't ask for anything And again, there is technically one other monster I have yet to face. Um, it's already close to 12.20 in the evening right now. Uh, I would like to get some sleep, so uh, let's just finish this once and for all. Who knows, I might take uh, 4th of July off, so that way I can celebrate my freedom from streaming this run. <laughs> And then, uh, come the following day, I can worry about, um, replaying this game via the actual retrospective. Uh, let's see, right now, anything to worry about? Um, I think 
think I did it just to be on the safe side. So I wasn't entirely sure if I saved or not. Um, save myself to trouble. Dialogue, expositional dialogue, expositional dialogue. I gained the power of the void. Can you believe it? I will suck up even more shit from there. Uh, but first, let me show you a magic trick. I be a tree. So yeah, moral of the story is, um, if not, um, out of five. Next step. If not, uh, happy 4th of July for everyone outside of America. Uh, in this case, happy Halloween. Underground. Um, I think you were um, away from the stream, but the last time I streamed this game, boy, was I super pissed off at the start of the game because apparently everyone started off with zero out of zero health, and the second I got into a battle, automatic game over. Had no idea how the fuck I was supposed to recover from that. Oh, so you were there, but yeah. What in the flying fuck was that? Just... Mm. But yeah, um, all our efforts were for not because we died. Well, that was a painless run. Don't know why I was so pissed off about that. Oh, wait, there's still more. <laughs> Who knows, maybe it was the game fucking up, or, yeah, it could just be me. Because, of course, it's always me. Man. Wolf. Old man. Grandpa! <laughs> and then, um, there's still one other person we're missing. That'll be changed sooner or later. Send another powerful dark void towards you. There we go. There's our fifth member. Yes, I'm not taking this cutscene seriously. That's going to be for the actual run. And of course, the game is telling us we should probably prep for this. Also, uh, just so we don't have to see the exposition dialogue. Once again, back up just so we can. Skip that cutscene and not worry about having to replay it again. Probably not much I can do about these uh, battles for magic. Maybe time magic, but not much of that. So I think what I'm going to do is... Actually, yeah. Leave that at that. Uh, 
Let's switch it out with dance. Yeah, keep you as that, and you as that. Because, um, if not for everything else, we'll still need it for, um, Mighty Guard, and especially, uh, for White Wind. So, Alright. So I was planning on having uh, ribbons on everyone. Not that big a deal. Just time for the final battle. The final battle to end all final battles, and honestly, that's not going to say much of anything. Also, in case you're wondering, uh, what's in a white hole? Yes. I should probably switch uh, Lena off of the Assassin's Dagger once we finish off X Death and move on to. Uh, X death is going to use the void to consume everything, including itself. So wait, does that mean we still win regardless? Probably not gonna work, but I have to try. Didn't think so. But more importantly, we gotta use the magic lamp. Not once. Not twice. But thrice to eliminate one of the forms. showed us which form was defeated. Also, I think was it um that or I'm trying to think of which one does Almageist. Which I think is the lion head. Oh, 
One way or another, we'll find out. Reserves, I think that's the real move I should be here. Um, the one that was just cast right now. Perfect time for me to get a bad itch, especially on my nose. The fact that it only hit one person, I am more than happy to take this. Besides, nothing a quick white wing can't fix. I, I agree. Try to confuse Neil X stuff. I believe you can do this. Really? I will attempt to believe you can do this. I am lying to myself that you can do this. Uh, seriously, I find it hilarious that I'm trying to do that. But yeah, were not for the sword dance ability, I would probably be doing shit damage against it right now. Plus I think, once one form is down, I can switch Ferris over. Uh, doing the meteor attack, which guess what I'm doing. You know what? It's not much of anything, but sure, why the hell not? Oh, you have a 
Meteor Spell 2, and a Vacuum Wave, and a... Ow. And a Ow. This is fine. That's not... That most certainly is not. Guess what? Uh, I'm not doing the floor of weeds anymore, Lord. Like nothing. This will finish you off. And there we go. This run is finished. Just gotta bide my time. And now. That should do it. <laughs> Although, uh, let, let, let's, let's stop this for a bit. Um, so, number one... I can be able to... Uh, number one, upload that so it's public. And more importantly, uh, copy link... Da, da, da. Next death, victory pick. Boom. And there we go. Complete run. Huh. <sighs> The run has been completed. Whew. Don't need to worry about anything else. So why don't we just quit to the top? No, no, no. Let's actually see this through the end. Ugh. Whew. We'll give credit where credit was due. Um, had some pretty good classes. Well, with Blue Mage, I pretty much won the game. Granted, um, that was mainly heavily due to Steel got me through, which I gotta remember every last detail that went through the uh, streams via VODs because there is no way I'm going to remember all of the blue magic spells on my own. So obviously, I'll need to remember all of that. Uh, but yeah, blue mage, if you know how it works, let alone how all the monsters work, while using the uh, level so-and-so spells easily can obliterate your enemies with it. Um, I'm trying to remember. What was the second one? Time Age. Um, what else is there to say about Time Age? The fact that, um, number one, you could be able to... Oh, and I still gotta press through the dialogue. Uh, speed up or slow down enemies was the main reason using that. But of course, in this version, uh, having all of two attack spells for Time Age, that being Comet, and once you beat the third of the dungeons for Tablets, uh, unlocking Meteor, which can do either great damage or shit damage via various different rolls um, for four times. Eh, it's okay. Uh, Geomancer, uh, let's move on to the next... <laughs> okay, seriously, let's talk about Geomancer. It's a shit job. The best thing the Geomancer has where you can avoid floor traps 
you use it all of two dungeons. And that's it. So there's nothing else to say about that. But yeah, even if those uh, three jobs didn't help me, the main backbone, as far as doing physical damage, the Dancer. Sure, it's a pain in the ass to deal with the undead uh, if you accidentally do Jitterbug and or Mystery Waltz against them. Or instead, you're actually giving them all of your magic points and health rather than the other way around. Um, yeah, since I really didn't have the best physical damager, and I'm not including blue mages, because yes, they're good physical attackers at the start of the game, especially with the run I had, they were decent. Once I unlocked Dancer and they were able to do Sword Dance, they easily uh, were able to make up in spades the damage they could have dealt. So yeah, um, despite my lack of knowledge for Blue Mages, um, this seed went surprisingly well. I am honestly in shock. It went by so well. In fact, I'm gonna double check. Um, how many run or runs, how many VODs of this did I do? Uh, let me see. Uh, including this one, five runs. And by runs, I mean five streams of this. So... Yeah, not that bad. This is easily one of those games where, um, obviously because of... The fact my first exposure to this game was via... Um, Anthology for the PS1. Not the best of experiences, let alone introductions to this game. So, I still say, as far as uh, top tier, low tier, what have you for Final Fantasy games, this one is still low due to that. But having said that, um, I'm going to be lenient towards this game. It's not that bad. Because, of course, there's um, 9, where my hatred for it is not necessarily because of the gameplay or the art style, but because the only way how I could get through that was via a strategy guide. That I still to this day swear it was 10% a strategy guide and 90% an advertisement for a website that I'm pretty sure nowadays doesn't exist anymore. So there's that one. And as for the other game that is shit here, let's let's finish um, all the other games up to 12 before we discuss that one because. Yeah, it's going to be painful anyway. <clears throat> but at least now we get to see the sweet epilogue that goes on. Sid gained a whole lot of weight and became Uncle Proton. He was so success happy about how things went out, he decided to use his grandson Mid as a boat. Although the Wind Drake from Val was no Ridley, it was the only Wind Drake we can use. So, it obtained a new level of Ridley. And unlike the past Ridley that was a Phoenix summon, this one is still hanging. But come Christmas time, oh, you bet it's gonna open up those presents like no tomorrow. 
Squeenix realized that the Moogles were one of the best mascots ever, so it became a prominent role come four, uh, four, come Final Fantasy VI and beyond. Lena, of course, returned to the throne and is now a successful entrepreneur for her kingdom. Although Ferris uh, still went back to the life of a pirate, uh, she still goes by the name Princess Salsa every now and then. People to this day call her the Salsi uh, Pirate Princess. Everyone is wondering why Kryl won't take up the throne. Uh, that's the least of her problems. Especially when... Um, Based on these sprites, her ponytail makes it look like it's the beak of a chocobo. While still wandering his way from down a different town from time to time again, he still made time to pay tribute to STELLA! Coco and Boko are the proud parents of three baby chocobo burbs. And might I say, they are adorable. Now it's time for a sepia tone clip show of <laughs> past events for some odd reason. Realizing his fascination um, with uh, the human anatomy, uh, Butts rechanged his name to Cheeks. Still hasn't got over that fetish, even to this day. Lena has um, decided to go on a contact high via dragon grass and poison shrubs. Doctors to this day still wonder when she'll come out of her coma. And of course, I already mentioned the stuff about <laughs> Ferris as the pirate princess Salsa. Mm, but that's one thing we can mention. Um, thanks to the Void being um, no longer a threat, uh, it was able to grant Ferris one wish, which was, of course, to revive Sildra, a.k.a. Duff McWhalen. You thought I was finished, but I am back. <laughs> Despite the death of her grandfather at the hands of X-Death, Kryle decided to open up a foundation in his Grandpa's name. And to this day, she's still smug as all hell that she beat the living shit out of butts. profitable <laughs> meme nonprofit organizations hell yes
wonder if it's now uh, auto scroll at this point because yeah I'm pressing nothing's happening Oh well, not really much for us to talk about now, except, um, uh, all right, nothing else left for us to talk about, except, um, yeah, I'm going to take the rest of the 4th of July off, so come Friday, July 5th. Um, we will, um, replay this game again, only this time, uh, it'll be for the retrospective, where <sighs> we'll see if I can do everything, considering the whole multiple boosts, uh, at this point, yeah, I may as well at least try and do everything, which is, of course, uh, I'm not too concerned about, um, Trying to max out levels, definitely maxing out all the jobs. Blech. But yeah, it only just occurred to me that, um... Pfft. Yeah, of course. Well, if I have the times four guild multiplier on... Chances are that's going to be a given. You know, call it a hunch, but I have a feeling that's going to be a given. thanks to the power of those burbs pooping on the ground, uh, flowers emerge. Yeah, that, that, that makes total sense. But I will admit, whether remastered or not, um, even if I'm not a huge fan of this game, much like Final Fantasy VIII, there is one good thing I can say about it. Nobuo Uematsu definitely knocks it out of the park with the music. I can't even say he scores a home run with uh, the music, but rather he scored us a grand slam! Thanks to Galoof the Grand Dad! So yeah, say what you will about um, Choco and Coco. Uh, the three baby burb uh, Chocobos have grown up. And more importantly, Growl's uh, riding on with me. Actually, no, no, no. You do have, you do have a point. Um, if I would describe Final Fantasy IX in one word, it would be Zell. Because, in my opinion, um, since I still have yet to play that game, or its sequels, the best way I could describe uh, 9 would be a fucking useless con. Because I do have visions of, I'm going to try and 100%, um, well, I'm definitely going to 100% 6 
Uh, attempt to do seven. And I think eight will be the last one I try. Emphasizing try to 100%. Everything beyond that is just no. Because then I will definitely become an old man and die of cardiac arrest before I even get close to finishing the rest of the games. I think I've pretty much uh, said my piece about um, Final Fantasy V right now, and even if I did have more to say about this game, let alone the Pixel Remaster, which I'm still going to say, not including the... not including the uh, Fiesta Run, as a joke, I was going to do the entire uh, Final Fantasy V game via Anthology Collection, just to make everyone else suffer. That was the intended plan, but then, um, obviously, Pixel Remaster came out with the whole boosts. More importantly, they patched the Steam version so that it, too, can give you the boost. It's like, okay, you know what? That's just going to make it go much smoother. Fuck that original plan. We're going with this version. So yeah, maybe, emphasizing maybe, I could have done the retrospective, uh, retrospective the Fiesta Run via uh, Anthology Collection, but at this point, if I'm just going to be doing... Um, 100% or at least 100% as much as possible uh, for doing everything in a natural run, no restrictions whatsoever. Uh, I think it's best I just stick with the Pixel Remaster because especially if not for leveling up or for grinding, Maxing out all the job levels, especially, especially Red Mage. Then, yeah, I am going to need uh, as much of a boost I will need to get through that. In fact, I'm going to do some math while this is going on. Uh, where is my calculator here? Let's boost this up. Uh, now let's see what the jobs listings have for us here. Because I want to try and prove to myself that, um, Red Mage would take the longest. So let's see. 10, 30, 50. So yeah, maxing out Knight would be 690, not even close to the last level of Red Mage. Uh, 
Closer by 10, but still not enough. And I'm not even gonna attempt with Blue Mage because that's just 350 altogether. Okay, we're gonna see from there. Um, let's see. Uh, next up, Thief. 10, 20, 30, 50, 75. 150, 300. Yeah. Not even enough to stop with the night class. Uh, that's a black mage. Just ten shy of the night. So yeah, that's not gonna work. And the same thing for the white mage, not gonna work. Five hundred for the berserker. So that ain't gonna work. Uh Mystic Knight. Same amount as the white and black mage. Ten, twenty. Ten, twenty, thirty, fifty. Significantly less than that. Uh, next up, let's check out Summoner. 15, 30, 45, 60, 100, 500. Seven hundred fifty for the summoner. Not bad. Not bad. But yeah, now we're coming up to the red mage, and believe me, you're gonna see a significant difference from this one. Let's see, twenty, forty, one hundred, and then out of fucking nowhere, nine hundred ninety-nine to give a total of eleven. 159. So unless I can see something that's at least a 1160 or more, to this day I still say Red Mage takes up the most space as far as learning. Well, let's see. Next up, 10, 50. 460 for the Beastmaster. Uh, Geomancer, 175. Simple, easy to master that one. And then, what about Ninja? Uh, let's see, 10, 30, 50. 
about as much as the knight, 690. Okay, nice times 10. Uh, bard, about the same as Geomancer, so skip that. Um, uh, Ranger. Let's see, 15. Plus 45. Plus 135. Plus 405. Solid 600. So yeah, only four more classes. I'm still not convinced of Elias. Uh, Samurai. Hundred eighty, five hundred forty. I'll give Samurai credit. It tried with eight hundred twenty. Uh, let's see. Solid six hundred for Dragoon. So no point for checking that out. Uh, Four hundred for the dancer. Six hundred thirty, and the last class, the mine, only has one level, which is nine hundred ninety-nine. So, as far as the top three, unless I miscalculated, it should be in order from most to least expensive. Um, Red Mage, Mine, and Samurai, and then from there the rest goes on. But I think I've rambled on for long enough. We've heard this music for long enough. Let's just get our save data. We'll save in file 20 so we know it's there. We'll finish it there. Four hearts together achievement. You still ah, there we go. So let's see, as far as the bestiary goes, uh, unless it needs to load up a certain file to do so. Eh, not bad. Still got at least what? Sixty-five more to take care of, and then the rest should take care of itself. So, yeah. It's not that big a deal. And uh, out of curiosity, I need to see. Uh, that was that. As far as um, dealing with achievements for this, uh, let's see. 27 out of 39 achievements done. This is a glorious sight to know about. Uh, for those of you wondering, yes, I did clear out 27 of 39 achievements. As far as the completion total, 69%. Uh, as a certain OP, I would say, yeah, baby. Uh, but <laughs> uh, yeah, for now, that's gonna do it for me, folks. Uh, I'm honestly surprised the stream took a bit longer than necessary. Uh, though, honestly, I really should be shocked, considering I started three and a half hours ago at, like, what, ten-something? Maybe even nine-something from there, so... Yeah. But with that said, I'd like to thank you all for watching, and thank you once again, Pan Anning, for the strong 11 
Uh, if you are new to this channel and haven't done so already, please be sure to uh, follow, leave a subscription, what have you, sorts. I do have several goals I am trying to reach. They, of course, being uh, if I am able to get a total of 202 followers, which is uh, 52 more followers compared to the previous one of 150, I will do a 100% completion, as much as possible, of X52 for the NES. Maybe I'll tackle more active enterprises once that happens, but we'll see. If I'm able to get five sub points, or, no, not five, uh, ten sub points, which right now, uh, six away, uh, I will do three full playthroughs of Undertale, which of course means doing the pacifist run, true pacifist run, and of course the dreaded genocide. And then the last two are donation-based. If I'm able to get a hundred uh, dollars total accumulation, I will do something brand new for this channel I have never tackled before, and I really want to showcase that off. And of course, two hundred dollar uh, total donation. I will do uh, playthroughs of various Chocobo-related games. So. The very least, Chocobo Dungeons 1 and 2 for the PlayStation, and even throw in Chocobo Racing for the PlayStation as well. But yeah, until then, uh, let's go ahead and see uh, exactly who I can send you all off to. Not that much going on, but if he's still going, we got a possible break. Been streaming for a while, um, so yeah, if we're gonna do this, we must do this now. I'll just give quick shout outs to Proton John, who's currently playing Metroid Prime 3 Corruption. Uh, we got details about Metroid Prime 4 if you're into the Metroid Prime series, so that's always a plus. And also, uh, speaking of uh, Throne Controllers, I'll also give a shout out to. Tom Fox is doing more uh, legendary Quagsire shiny hunting. Uh, but yes, while he is still online, we are going to go ahead and raid Bigatron Double Zero. And our raid message shall be as follows. Time Age, Geomancer, and Dancer run completed. But yeah, as I said, I'm going to take the rest of 4th of July off, and then we will uh, tackle yet another uh, full playthrough of Final Fantasy V for the retrospective uh, come Friday. So until then, folks... Take care, and I will see you all later, everyone. No, with your banner, we just gotta raid Nicotron before he ends streaming, so... Laters!